thought I might do a bit of an update. It's been a couple of years since my last uh, little video. Uh, it's uh, August at the moment, so a bit more rain than uh, on the last one. I'm not sure if you can see it, but there's our collection point underneath all that water. Still working away, haven't made any changes or anything, uh, just give it a bit of a clean a couple of times over the last uh, couple of years. But a lot more rainfall than last year, uh, last time I did a video. Here's a little pelt wheel, still ticking over. Come down and give it a grease once a year. Haven't, uh, haven't had to do anything else about it, any more to it I should say. Had a look at some of the comments on the web page and uh, some people asking about why one of the taps was nearly turned off and the other one on. Um, that's to uh, vary the water flow. We, we don't need as much power as this can produce, so we just turn it, turn it back a bit. Um, if we do need more power, like when we're having up the guests over or whatever, I just open up both valves and you can turn on everything. Um, but the way we're running things at the moment. Um, we need a little bit of extra power to run the heater in the morning and uh, the toaster and such. Um, but uh, yeah, we don't need full, full capacity. Another question was about all the bends and elbows. And yes, straightening all that out would improve the efficiency, but um, a lot less effort would be required just to, to go a bit further up the stream and give a few more metres ahead and that would give a, a similar result if not better. Um, these big pipes if they're running at full flow the elbow would make a difference but they are only coming down to a small couple of small jets of a couple of millimetres each so the, the bends don't make a significant difference in the uh, output. <laughs> 